My name is Roland and I'm the Managing Director of the Platform Industry 4.0 Austria. Industry 4.0 is not just a short-term trend, but it will fundamentally change the way we work, the way we do business, but also the way we live. We as a platform have a very broad view on the various technologies of Industry 4.0 and on many other aspects. Hello, my name is Nicolina and I'm an advisor at the Platform Industry 4.0 in Austria. I'm responsible for the topics human in the digital factory, security and safety, and norms and standards. Industry 4.0 demands for the human in the factory. Workers will be faced with a lot of new jobs and through the support of technical systems, they can realize their full potential and adopt their role as a decision maker or problem solver. Concerning security and safety, it has to be mentioned that manufacturing companies rely on data to run their production processes. Cybersecurity professionals have to, to make this topic relevant and accessible to non-technical stakeholders, and that's why Industry 4.0 requires an evolving cybersecurity perspective. In order for the real world to be connected with the virtual world in the sense of Industry 4.0, norms and standards has to be the basis. It's whether in communication, production, IoT or security. Hi, hi my name is Michael and I'm project manager of Digital Pioneers. Industry 4.0 is offer, offering plenty of job opportunities for young people in a digital and tech, technical professional environment. Um, we observe that young people or young men and especially young women miss out on these job opportunities because they simply do not know what different types of jobs are out there. So with the Digital Pioneers or the goal of the Digital Pioneers project is um, to create an environment uh, in which young women may experience uh, a, a technical and digital job. and experience job orientation in such an environment. I'm Yasmina and I'm responsible for qualification and competencies for Industry 4.0, regional strategies and communications at the platform Industry 4.0 Austria. Due to digitization, uh, there is an increasing demand for more qualifications, more digital skills, more interdisciplinary skills um, in general. And especially in the manufacturing industry, there is an increasing need for IT specialists, but also knowledge in uh, STEM in general, uh, as well as in areas of uh, machine learning systems, artificial intelligence, IoT, cybersecurity, um, 3D printing, robotics, etc. And in order to respond to these increasing uh, requirements, um, in uh, re regional qualification clusters have been formed uh, in uh, certain economic uh, regions in Austria and uh, for example the aim and work of the platform is here to um, bring all stakeholders together in order to exchange knowledge and to exchange best practices. My name is Michael and I'm mainly dealing with two topics, the first one being research development and innovation, the second one being resource and energy efficiency. In the area of R&D and innovation, data is becoming more and more important when it comes to innovation and many projects are being started on the topic. There are many challenges in the field when it comes to dependencies, security or when it comes to the choice of uh, a data company or a cloud service of hosting data on-premise or in the cloud. And there's many solutions for that, the, the major one being exchange of information and experience where we try to facilitate the exchange. When it comes to resource and energy efficiency, this is at the core of Industry 4.0 as those technologies help you to save energy and to save resources. In this field, it becomes more and more important to track the impacts, the different impacts in this field and to, to, to exchange information on that. Also in this area, we as a platform are facilitating this exchange. Hi, my name is Paul. I'm responsible for business models at the platform Industry 4.0. In the area of business models, there is a big shift from selling products to providing services. The challenge is adding value to your data by creating services. And the solution would be to implement a broad variety of sensors and software in order to secure exchange and usage of the data. You have heard a lot of different aspects of Industry 4.0. The biggest challenge is if you 
try to implement an industry 4.0 solution into your business, you have to take into considera consideration all the various aspects you have just learned of. It's about technology, it's about new business models, it's about training people, it's about changing uh, the workforce, it's about organizational change, it's about security issues, etc. And one of the major um, challenges is the integration of all these parts. And w one of the solutions is reducing complexity. If you learn about what is the best way to introduce a new technology, what is the technology selection, if you talk about norms and standards that could help you um, finding a solution and then transfer it into new business models, that's one of the ways forward to introduce Industry 4.0 successfully.